Hello dear users of digital photogrammetric workstation photo mode. Today video tutorial will be devoted to peculiarities of creation and preliminary processing of Pashbroom scanner data. As far as new satellites are launched, to an orbit we try to support processing of their data. A list of supported satellite scanner data are represented in photo mode user guide and in website of Rackers company. To create a test project, let's start photo mode and press corresponding button in project management window. Create. Define project name. S. Hobart. And select its type as satellite scanner imaging. Specify coordinate system, double J CT4, projection UTN zone 55 in southern hemisphere, relief elevation from 0 to 1300 meters. Specify a placement to store the project. OK. Let's create new strip. Then source satellite data should be converted to internal photo mode format, MST. Let's images from files. Find the folder with source data in the left side of the window. press search button. Pay attention that photogrammetic processing in photo mode is available just for images with a specific level of pre-processing. Non-photogrammetric images are shown in red ones without any orientation data are shown in yellow. In my case, all images are available for photogrammetic processing. Information about processing level as a rule is contained in the metadata file. For GOI images, which will be loaded to our project, this file looks like this. Product line GEO and processing level as standard geometrically corrected indicate that these are non rectified images which can be processed photogrammetically in photo mode. If necessary, look through properties of every image which with help of this button details. With this button you can also change aerodiametric correction of each image. Initially, 16 bits satellite images look like absolutely black ones. It's due to its brightness range is filled not at all. Using of the levels enables to trim insignificant edges of brightness distribution with the run. Selection of after level mode was in detail considered in thematic webinar. You can find this webinar from our website in bookmark training webinar aerodynamic processing of satellite images in photo mode. If you have a high quality quick look image uh, which, as a rule, is delivered along with source satellite data, it's recommended to use it feed directly when we talk about applying after levels.
if you have two set of data, low resolution multispectral images and high resolution pen images, you can do pan sharpening for them. Please specify show detail as option and press search button. In opened window, please perform radiometric correction for each image using quick look after levels for radiometric correction. Of course, quick look should be used just in case uh, when its radiometric properties are rather good. So repeat this operation for each image. Now it's time to perform pan sharpening. Let's select pan images from the top list and multispectral image from the bottom list. Press OK. As a rule, default parameters are enough to perform pan sharpening. Let's do the same operation for the second pair of images. OK, now we can add images. To the project, if necessary, we may Store it in project folder or in any other folder in our computer. Default parameters of uh, converting source images into MST format looks like this. Uh, I will not perform uh, this convocation once again. I just press cancel and uh, add already prepared pan sharpening images for this project since pan sharpening needs to expire sometime add images from resources and select two already prepared images and they look like this Depending on rate of uh, relative overlapping, there are two kinds of image sets, monoblock and stereoblock. Monoblock is a set of images with a small overlapping rate without intersection angle enough for creation of accurate DTM. To be used for monoblock creation, images can be taken from different sensors, different period of time, with arbitrary nadir of angle. For processing monoblock projects, please use recommendations from our webinar dedicated to block adjustment of satellite images. I mean this webinar. In our case, it's a question of stereo block project. Stereo block is a set of images with a big overlapping rate and intersection angle optimal for creation of accurate DTM. Stereo block should consist of images taken strongly from the same sensor with the same channels number in the same time period. While processing stereo blocks, every stereo pair should be placed in separate strip. In our case, this condition have been already done. Then it's necessary to measure type points. It's necessary not only for forming stereo pairs, but also for refinement of exterior orientation parameters 
and decrease of search area while creating DTM later. If you have enough number of GCPs measured in both images, these GCPs will be ties as well. Please import GCPs. Select field separator, suitable field separator, in my case V is comma. And now you should measure ground control points, you should indicate them in the images. Uh, the algorithm of measuring GCPs in images uh, has been already demonstrated from one of our mm, previous video tutorials. Now I just show you how to do it on example of the one point. So I need uh, sketch to find the position of the first point B1 point, B101 point is located in the center of road intersection. I select it in the triangulation points list. I place my marker into the center of this road intersection. Uh, make my images left and press insert button from the keyboard. Then I locate my marker near to the same position in the second image and press this button to delete all images to left. If marker you are moved to right position, I agree with this report. So now you see that two measurements were done uh, for B101 point. In order to avoid to performing the same operations for all the other ground control points, I just import already prepared file with measurements. Now I have 13 ground control points. Now let's step to the block adjustment. Please open corresponding toolbar. And press parameters button. In points bookmark activate option of type points usage. And specify coordinates delta threshold a 0.1 pixel. If you have them preliminary imported to photo mode, it can be loaded to accelerate adjustment and to compensate additional errors caused by small intersection angle. Images bookmark. In the left side of images bookmark, you see information about loaded images, sensor name GOI1, and of nadir angle. In our case, its value across orbit is indicated. Depending on data type, presence of exterior and interior orientation information in it, there are three basic algorithms of processing satellite scanner images. Rigorous method is used when exterior and interior orientation parameters are known as well as coordinate of orbit position. This processing method is typical to remote sense data from such sensors as resource decay, for Massar, 
Fair Aster, ALCB, etc. Generic method is used when there is no information about orbit position, exterior and interior orientation parameters. This processing method is typical to remote sense data from such sensors as Resource Decay, Landsat 7, IRS, LS Admiral, etc. RPC method is algorithm which use for adjustment containing in metadata information about rational polynomial coefficients. These coefficients can stitch it links between pixel coordinates of image and coordinates of points in the terrain. GOI images we used an example of RPC processing type. Depending on processing, algorithm and project type, monoblock or stereo block, different demands are made to number of ground control points and type points in the project. Please see the table from Photomod user guide. We deal with RPC, algorithm, stereo block and the images from GOI1 image, from GOI uh, sensor. Uh, for this type of images, it's recommended to use uh, from one to four ground control points, from one to two checkpoints and three four eye points in area of quadruple overlapping, if it exists. Correspondingly, 13 GCPs that we import into the projects should be enough for adjustment by uh, RPC algorithm. So, if you if you have high performance graphic card in your computer, it can be used as computing device instead of CPU. Uh, regarding image groups, they constitute a set of images taken from the same server strip and artificially split it before delivery. Images of one group should be taken from the same sensor, the same time period, with the same nadir of angle. Image groups are needed for decrease of GCP's number in the project, for acceleration of adjustment and improvement of object's conjunction along image cut lines. Image groups are not used without measured tie points. It's possible to create image groups manually or automatically based on project strips or by metadata. Since testing block is small and number of GCPs is enough in it, we will not create image groups. To create stereo pairs based on project images, it's necessary to activate corresponding button, corresponding option, create stereo pairs. Uh, generally, stereo pairs are created based on images from the same strip but if necessary, it's possible to form them based on images from different strips. Option of uh, epipolar images creating will be activated automatically. Please be sure it's really done in a such way. Regarding adjustment steps, this process constitutes a splitting of source data set on groups and adjustment of such groups step by step. All images adjusted on the initial steps will be used as correct for the next steps. Adjustment steps should be used if you have in the project a big number of images. In addition, it will be useful in a case where you need to tie non-accurate data, for example, low resolution images with accurate data, high resolution images. Steps number are not limited. We will not use adjustment steps since uh, we have just two images in our project. Refinement parameters. They enable to change source RPC. After refinement is specified in default. In that case, refinement type is designated automatically based on GCP and type points number in the project. After using of bias option, a constant refinement will be added to RPC. 
we recommend to use one of these options after or bytes. In specific cases, for example, for monoblocks, it's recommended not to use a refinement at all. It's necessary to identify and to fix errors and type points. You can find more information about such case from above-mentioned webinar dedicated to satellite images block adjustment. A priori covariances of parameters uh, they enable to determine an accuracy of source RPC and accuracy of coordinate system selection. For example, in case of approximation of local coordinate system. Uh, bias is calculated in pixels. It constitutes a priori RMC role in absolute terms of refinement equation. Drift is calculated in parts per million. It constitutes RMC role in linear coefficients of refinement equation. We recommend to leave these parameters as is. Please uh, press OK and perform block adjustment. Brief information about x, y and z position errors of GCPs is represented in a residual report. Errors in images are located in the top part of the window, errors in models in the bottom part of the window. Errors in images are given in pixels, errors in models in meters of the terrain. To estimate the quality of source satellite images, it's possible to specify all ground control points as checkpoints. Okay, let's do it once again since uh, one point remains as control. Uh, let's change its status to check and to adjust block once again. Changing all types of ground control points to check allow to estimate an uh, coincident accuracy of GCPs between each other and accuracy of points position uh, determining with using just source RPC. Uh, residuals of checkpoints uh, is about 9-10 meters in Z and about 3 meters in XY plane. A difference between mean and maximum values of residuals uh, show that expected accuracy of exterior orientation can be equal 30 centimeters in XY plane and about 1 meter in Z. If increase uh, real scale of uh, residuals this plane uh, we can see that uh, direction of XY plane errors uh, are the same. It uh, indicates a systematic errors in RPC. All XY plane errors directions uh, direct to the east southeast so using of uh, just one arbitrary ground control point leads to dramatic decrease of systematic error influence upon accuracy of exterior orientation parameters uh, let's do it as control and to adjust a block and now we see that errors by ground XY is dramatically less than it was earlier. Residual of checkpoints in Z 
is about 2 meters and about half meters in this high plate. Visual representations of the rows by ties and by grounds on images uh, and on models is similar to their representation in central projection projects. We talk about it, uh, we talk about them in previous video tutorials. Uh, as you see, red symbols indicate errors, over acceptable residuals, uh, green symbols, unacceptable residuals. Uh, acceptable residuals then helps were specified in the report book Markov parameters of the JASP. To represent just points, errors of which are over acceptable residuals, filter is used by residual value over acceptable residuals. If you want to see just time images, do it or show all errors both for ground, x, y, z and time images. If necessary, you may remeasure point uh, that is shown as our acceptable residuals. In addition, uh, you may change its state from tie to excluded. And after it, this ground control or checkpoint will not participate in adjustment. Final adjustment result depends on accuracy of GCP's identification in images as well as on accuracy of GCP's coordinates themselves. After setting of uh, 11 points as ground control and after setting 2 points as check, Adjustment results look like this. If necessary, you can see report in detail for each point of the block with using this button Create Report. By the way, you may look at residuals of which point in its attributes and corresponding points attributes window. After adjustment is completed, please save its results by pressing corresponding button. Subsequent processing of the project, I mean DTM creation, order rectification, state factorization, etc. etc will be performed in a way similar to processing of central projection project. Thus, today we have considered a procedure of creation and preliminary processing of Fashbroom scanner imagery project, with a stop in adjustment 